New tonight, crews are demolishing what's left of the home that exploded in flames in a New Hampshire neighborhood. And as WBZ's Julie McDonald explains from Salem, investigators found a body and traps as they sifted through the debris. Well, we've learned that this now leveled house was set to be seized by the town because of unpaid taxes. That town action scheduled for right around the time yesterday that neighbors noticed a hissing sound and the strong odor of gas. I'm not surprised that it happened. I was wondering that if he might do something like that. Neighbors in Salem, New Hampshire, a little rattled, but not exactly shocked as they learn more about a fiery house explosion and apparent suicide on Monday. We have located the body of one white male. Uh, he has uh, appears to uh, be deceased by a self-inflicted gunshot wound. The condemned house and car in the driveway belong to Charles Hill, the former occupant with whom neighbors have had some bizarre run-ins. When we were younger, that's a house you didn't go trick-or-treating at. He would come outside and bang pots and pans around and be kind of crazy. It does look like kind of a hoarder situation where he is, you know, um, has a lot of stuff. There's some vehicles, there's some uh, stacks of firewood and piles of wood and all different kinds of random things in his yard. As investigators sifted through those mounds of debris, they also found what appeared to be traps, including nails poking up near entrances to the house. 1.4 G uh, explosives that was probably consumer grade fireworks. Uh, as we reported before, uh, we had a lot of ammunition going off yesterday. Police were called to 20 Irving because of a neighbor's dispute. Those responding officers just feet from the house when it exploded. We don't know if our officers walked in on something that he was preparing for. And the fire chief tells us they do believe they've determined the location where the fire started, but are still looking into just how. In Salem, New Hampshire, Julie McDonald, WBZ News.